the Jingle Bell Lady. Hey friend, today's video I'm gonna be sharing with you 12 things that I think you should be grabbing at the thrift store for your holiday home decor. I don't know about you, but as soon as Thanksgiving's over, I get this rush of holiday spirit and I just wanna decorate for holidays. And it's not really before that. I love to celebrate fall and I like to keep fall as long as it will go. But now I'm switched and now we're into the holiday spirit zone. So I'm going to be decorating for the holidays very, very soon. And I wanted to bring you on my thrift trip recently because I was able to pick up a ton of holiday decor and I'm excited to decorate with it this year. Let's go to the footage from the other day and then we'll come back here and I will share with you what I grabbed and what I think you should be grabbing too. All right, let's do it. Let's go thrifting. Okay, so I'm headed out to go thrifting today, hoping to find some good holiday stuff. I'm gonna crank up the Christmas music and I'm going to shop for Christmas and I'm excited. So let's see what we can find at the thrift store and hopefully they have some great stuff. Okay, so here we are back at the house. So let's get into that list. We have 12 things to go through. The first item on the list is of course, the bauble ornaments. I love to use bauble ornaments on my tree. I think they bring such a beautiful dimension to the tree. And finding them at the thrift store is what you need to do because they are so inexpensive. This whole bag here was $1. They're gold and red and I actually got I got a couple of these as well for one dollar each and I just love to have a beautiful tree and this will help me do that on a budget so I love looking for bobble ornaments first thing. The second thing you should be looking for are specialty ornaments. Ornaments that just stand out to you that look beautiful and different. I love these ones right here. I found these for 50 cents each. I thought they were so pretty and they're going to add a nice dimension to the tree because they have some cool holographicness behind the gold. So I thought those are really neat. Okay. These are so cute. I found these little Santas. How, how adorable are these? And I actually have five of them. So they're going to really, really stand out on the tree this year. They're so pretty. Are they cute? So looking for specialized ornaments is such a great idea because they can be expensive at the store. And like I said, these were about 50 cents each at the thrift store and usually they're pretty inexpensive. So check those out. The next thing on the list are candlesticks. 
and candles. These are some that I picked up recently and I just love a good candlestick. And it's so beautiful at the holidays, especially to decorate with candlesticks. These are classic. They're nice and heavyweight and you can switch out the candles for different colors, all sorts of different things. They have candles and candlesticks all over the thrift store. So check it out. And that's what you should be looking for. Okay. The next thing is cozy blankets. I found a great one the other day. This one is red and really beautiful it has nice tassels and it's so cozy now the thing about this is you want to make sure you wash them really really well before you use them don't just stick them on the couch you know some of these specialized ones will need extra attention because they have tassels i have ruined some blankets that way but just be careful <laughs> and buy ones that you love and will help you decorate for the holidays because they're soft and cozy and beautiful Next thing you should look for are wreaths and garlands. I found a whole box of garland for like $4. Grab that. I can't really show it to you because it is, it's a ginormous box, but I did grab this beautiful wreath and I'll show it to you now. I'm going to put it on my front porch. I might do a little zhuzhing to it, but I thought the bow was beautiful and this was beautiful. I paid, let's see, I think it was $4 for this one. I just thought it was very classic. I actually liked the snowy look on there. I thought that was so pretty. So keep an eye out for beautiful wreaths at your stores and garlands too. Like I said, people donate all sorts of stuff. So check it out. Right, the next thing are holiday books. I grabbed a few this time. This is for my boys. It's the night before Christmas and it's a pop-up book. They are going to love it. Who doesn't love a good pop-up book? Isn't that adorable? So this will be really fun to have for the holidays. And I will have to keep an eye on it though because they like to destroy things like this sometimes, but I thought it was so cute. So this is a great one. I also picked up this, You Are Special by Max Lucado. It's such a great story, perfect for the holidays. We love to read holiday books at night during bedtime during the holidays. So this will be one on rotation. I love them. Such a good one. You're not going to be surprised by this, but I love to grab baskets for the holidays. My plan for this is to put a whole bunch of Christmas baubles in here that don't fit on my tree and they can be a nice decoration around. I think it's pretty pretty with one of those little tiny trees in here. I don't know. There's many options for baskets. If you see one that you like, that's a good holiday basket. I recommend picking it up. This one was only $1. Okay. I have something on the list that might surprise you. This is Jingle Bells. I found this Jingle Bell wreath and I just thought this was really perfect. And what better way to, sorry, I'll try to keep it quiet. What better way to bring into the festive spirit by having some jingle bells around? I also grabbed these ones, which I will be tying to packages and gifting to people. I think these are really fun for that reason. And Merry Christmas. Look for jingle bells if you can find them and put them somewhere where you can enjoy. I love to look for figurines and things that make me smile that I can put around the house and decorate with. Things like nutcrackers, houses, things like that. I did find a few this time around. Okay, how cute is this Santa? And he's supposed to dance. I haven't got him to dance yet, but I need to just change out the batteries and hopefully he'll work. He might not never, he might not ever work, but I just thought he was really cute. Anyway, he was $2 and well worth it, I think, because he's so cute. I found this cardinal bird figurine. I love birds, I love cardinals. This will be really cute on a shelf, and I'm excited to have this. I thought it was really sweet. So the next thing I look for while thrifting, and I think you should too, are things for your advent calendar. Now, everybody does their advent calendar differently, and the way I do it is I have my kids open up a package every single day for 12 days, and they get to have an ornament, 
to put on the tree and then they get to do an activity or we do something as a family. It's just different every single day, but it's really fun. Um, so this year I found these really special ornaments that are called the 12 day of Christmas collection. So I thought these would be perfect to go in our advent calendar and it's the 12 days of Christmas song. From the song, it has all the different ornaments. So this is the first day of Christmas. My true love gave to me a partridge in a pear tree. So here he is. And then we have all different 12. So I think this will be fun to add to our holiday tradition of the advent calendar. And I think you should also look for the thrift store for things like that. Also for the advent calendar this year, I grabbed this little set of wooden ornaments that my kids will be decorating for their Christmas tree. They have a little mini tree in the entryway and they'll decorate these and put those on for one of the days of our advent. So just things like that, you can look at, find different items. Whatever your special holiday tradition is, look for things at the thrift store that can help you accomplish those things. You don't have to spend a lot of money to make holiday memories. So that's my tip for that. The last thing on the list is a nativity set. I love nativity sets. There are little glass figurines. This is a wise man. This is Mary. And we have the wise man and Joseph. And of course, the most important baby Jesus. Over the years, I've found a few different nativity sets and they're each special to me in different ways. And I just loved this one, how classic it was. And I thought it was so beautiful. There is so much great stuff out there. I hope this gave you some ideas on things you can be looking for while you're shopping for your home decor this year. Don't forget to check out those thrift stores. And I hope you have a beautiful day today, my friends. Santa and I are signing off and we'll see you next time. Bye.